All right, Brian, about 20 minutes before 7 o'clock. Parents, certainly a scary time when your baby starts picking things up with his or her fingers. It just takes a second, and the little ones can have something in their mouths that they shouldn't. Consumer investigator Kristen Byrne shares one mom's story in hopes that it will help other parents. Research has shown choking is a leading cause of injury among kids, especially those four and younger. One mom says when her toddler got a hold of two tiny magnets, it almost cost him his life. <laughs> Isadora Lawyer is a feisty, <laughs> happy three-year-old. Not much keeps him down, except one night a few months ago. He was screaming. With, uh, with every minute that passed, his, his vomiting became much more intense. She rushed him to the ER where an x-ray revealed Izzy had swallowed two small magnets. We had a succulent garden that we made. One like this, made out of wine corks and magnets. A few magnets fell on the floor and Izzy found them. They got stuck in his intestines and, and then the two pieces of the intestines stuck together causing a bowel obstruction. Tearing three holes in Izzy's intestine and one in his colon. Looks like little bullet holes in his intestines. Rocky Mountain Hospital for Children's Pediatric Surgeon Dr. Sarah Lai took out part of Izzy's intestine and a small part of his colon. She says Izzy isn't the first and magnets are not the only problem. Button batteries produce electric currents that can burn the esophagus. Safety pins, nails, and any objects larger than two centimeters in width and five centimeters in length can tear up the digestive tract. And laundry or dishwasher detergent pods are loaded with harsh chemicals that can cause respiratory arrest, seizures, and comas. I guess my message is just don't buy them. It's not worth it. Certain toys and games that have small parts are required by law to come with a caution label. I'm consumer investigator Kristen Byrne.